I don't care how many American preachers will lie to you. Mm. America is not written in the Bible. Mm. Oh. Oh. We can find Trump. We yes, can sir. find Obama as yes. examples of some other kings that were in the Bible. Mm. And these guys type in, they are typing shadows, shadows. Mm. of mm. the same people. Oh, wow. yes. But to say America, why would the Bible miss America? Mm. 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 Hello. Welcome to my YouTube channel. I am, I am, I am your boy, the Kenyan beast. Of course, uh, we are doing it the African way every day, every time. Now there is this this pastor. There is a video. Uh, he said that um, the USA was not in the Bible. Donald Trump, Joe Biden, all these presidents uh, are in the Bible, but uh, USA was not in the bible now this is a um, theory that i've had for a long time some are saying that usa is the babylon of the bible some are saying usa is not in the bible like this pastor is saying that there is nowhere in the bible where united states of america was mentioned and why is it that superpower why is it that uh, america is superpower and yet it was not in the bible let us listen to this video and then we'll talk about it. If the Bible is correct, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 66 books of the Bible, oh, yes, if they are correct and they are prophetic, mm. how on earth did they miss that they will be in America? Mm. Mm. Come on, come on. Bring it, bring it. Bring no, it you on, see, mm. it's questions you never ask mm. because I don't care how many American preachers will lie to you. Mm. America is not written in the Bible. Mm. Oh. oh. We can find Trump, we yes, can sir. find Obama yes. as, as examples of some other kings that were in the Bible. Mm. Oh, yes. And these guys type in, they are typing shadows, shadows. Mm. of mm. the same people. Oh, wow. yes. But to say America, why would the Bible miss America? Yeah, the yeah. Bible has been proven to be... 100% correct, mm. inherent and sufficient in its nature. Mm. Yes. But the same Bible misses the greatest nation on earth. Mm. Mm. The most powerful nation on earth. Mm. The greatest ally of Israel on earth. Mm. The greatest defender of the chosen people on earth mm. is not written in the Bible. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. No a single prophet mentioned America. Uh -huh. Russia we know is there because it goes says to the far the furthest north. Yes, sir. Oh, yes, and we yes, know sir. the British Isles are there because they are mentioned. Mm -hmm. Yes, sir. But they are not mentioned as the British Isles, they're mentioned by location. Mm -hmm. oh, yes, oh, yes. So we know Britain is there. Mm -hmm. We know Russia is in is yes, included. Mm -hmm. So we, we have a certain way of understanding these are the nations. Or we can go back to other nations that are written, oh, yes. like you will get to, to Togama, mm -hmm. Goma. You you, you you then go into history and go like which country is this? Oh, yes. Mm. You find Turkey is there. Mm -hmm. yes, you sir. find Russia is written there. Mm -hmm. Yes, sir. You find Iran is written there. Oh, yes. Mm. Why America is not it's written? Not 21 educational institutions, including Harvard, mm. Yale. These are 20 of the first 21 mm -hmm. educational facilities, or rather, Institutions to be built in America like Harvard, mm -hmm. Yale, and all these. Mm -hmm. Twin of the 21 oh, yes. were all founded on the pretext of having the facilities to facilitate evangelists being trained there mm -hmm. so that they can send them to nations. Oh. Mm -hmm. Yes, that same Harvard you're talking about, wow. that same Yale we're talking about. Wow. Oh. So the question then is, what is happening to America? Uh -huh. What is happening to America is because it's not written in the Bible. Mm. Mm. Oh. Mm. So since it's not written in the Bible and we find it as a superpower now, it means America has to stop being a superpower before mm. the rapture happens or within the rapture period. Oh, yes. Mm. Oh, yes. uh -huh. No, you do, you're not getting it. Hey. Hey. Wow. Because if it becomes a superpower before mm. the rapture, mm -hmm. or, or, or <laughs> After the rapture is still a superpower, mm. there is a problem in the missing in the prophetic. Mm. They missed it somewhere. Oh, yes. Mm. That's right. That's right. But because the Bible doesn't miss, yes, America is not a superpower when Jesus returns. Mm. Oh, yes. oh. <laughs> come on, I don't know if they're getting come this. Oh. Wow. So we know for sure the rapture is, is imminent. Why? Mm. Because bricks is here. Oh, yes. Mm. Uh huh. Uh -huh. We see all the building blocks of people trying to make America not to be 
a superpower. Mm. Uh, wow. They are already in motion. All the engines and the systems are already in motion yes, for sir. America not to be a superpower. Yes, sir. Way back, you wouldn't fight with America and do. Now we are in years, Ukraine, mm. and America is sponsoring money after mm. money, weapon after money. Oh, yes. We are failing to dethrone Putin. Mm. Why? Because it's not a superpower. Yes, sir. Oh. It's failing to be what it was. Yes, sir. Hey. The dollar is losing value. Why? Mm. Because America doesn't have to be a superpower when the rapture is happening. Mm. Oh. Wow. Get this is the reason why America is moving into Africa mm. and trying to regain its former mm. glory. Mm -hmm. They are talking to countries. They are setting bases and military bases, even in Zambia here. Yes. Mm. Uh -huh. That's right. Why? Because they want to destabilize the region. Mm. And if they destabilize the region, mm. what they are trying to do there is to gain power, oh. consolidate its power. Mm. Why? Because they know, they themselves know we are no longer a superpower. superpower. Wow. Hey, let me tell you something. It started with moral decadence. Mm -hmm. the, the fall in moral values of people. Oh, yes. mm -hmm. To the point that we, right now, if you look at the moral decadence, the level of the fall of a nation that was built on Christian principles mm -hmm. by Christians, for Christians, mm -hmm. they don't know who to vote for. You put Trump here, you put Biden here, you put their principal Biden, he's saying, I'm for abortion. Mm -hmm. Trump says no. Mm -hmm. Hey. You still don't know who to vote for as a Christian. Mm. Wow. Welcome back. A lot of things that are written in the Bible, a lot of um, um, stories that are in the Bible, um, they are coming to pass. They are coming to pass. Sometimes I sit down and wonder, is a Bible a storybook was written? Are we living a script? Is a Bible a script of the life? Or... Some people sat down and decided to write the Bible, so they are using the Bible to, to, to do all these things. They are using the Bible as the script to script the life of the people. Because a lot of things about a new world order, about a coming of Antichrist, about um, the Babylon, about uh, these world wars and everything, it's happening. Sometimes, I'm not saying it's true, but sometimes I sit down and wonder if some people sat down and wrote the Bible as the script of life, as the script of what they are doing, as they remember that they need to do something. So they are, they written it in a, you know, in a way that it's not understandable that easily, but they know what they did. Sometimes I ask myself that question. But everything that is in the Bible, it's passing. The war that we are seeing, how USA is losing its power, how Russia is rising, Israel, we are seeing it in the Bible. And uh, a lot of people are saying that Babylon is the current USA. Now, this pastor is saying USA was not in the Bible. I've tried to do research. You know, I don't know much about some countries are mentioned in the Bible, but um, in a way that you need to dig down. Maybe another country is mentioned like Northwest, Far West, Far North, so it's, it's hard to know if a country is written in the Bible. But Africa is in the Bible. Iran is in the Bible. Turkey is in the Bible. Egypt is in the Bible. A lot of countries are in the Bible. But why USA is not in the Bible? Do you agree with him that USA is not in the Bible? And why is it so that superpower? Now, this is so spiritual. It's a matter of things that are, if you want to understand, you need to dig deep, deep in a spiritual world. Yeah. All in all, it's a black pastor. Uh, the, the, we came with a sort of black Jesus, and it's like it's true. Jesus was black. Uh, a lot of stories have come out, but this one about USA not being in the Bible is somehow deep. It's somehow deep. It's like USA is an illusion. I don't know. But all in all, about USA opening its walls or its gates for people to come in, we have heard stories about like that one that it's happening and it was in the Bible. About the war that is being planned every now and then, it's being in the Bible. About Donald Trump, it's being in the Bible. So a lot of things 
a lot of things happening in the world is in the bible so is the bible a script of life because everything we're living is like it was scripted before they knew it will come a time when usa will be struggling with the superpower and that's why usa is struggling to enter africa to gain powers I'm waiting for a time when Africa will be great. When Africa will be united. Because all these wars we see, this unity we see across Africa is because once Africa will unite, it's over for all of these continents. But again, they are fighting for one presidency, one currency, one one leader. It is in the Bible too. Does it mean we are living the end of times? I don't know. Tell me in the comment section what do you think about this uh, pastor, what he has just said. Because I think there is more into this. Those who are reading, we have to do a lot of research and knowing this kind of things. Tell me in the comment section what you think about this video. I am the Kenyan Beast, of course. We are doing it the African way. Peace be with you.